Hey, good morning, it's Will with Everlasting Capital. Hey, good morning, it's Will with Everlasting Capital. Hi, good morning, it's Will with Everlasting Capital. Are you boring your customers? What are you doing on the phone every single day? Are you the same monotone coming in, doing the drill? Hi, this is Will with Everlasting Capital. We offer equipment financing and leasing and working capital for your business. Are you interested? Boring. You have to be active and you have to be, you have to have so much fire on every single call that you need to go into it just spunked up, ready to go, like assume the sale. Every cold call, assume there's a sale in that call. You need to do that, right? You can start with humor. Some people like humor. Others, they hate humor. They don't like humor at all. So you got to mirror the person on the other end of the line. Yeah, you can have the same tonality on the intro call or you can switch it up. I would suggest switching it up every single time and see what works for you. See what works on every single call. You'll never know until you actually try switching up your tonality, switching up your voice, switching up um, your pitch, switching up your opening. It's got to be a short 10, 15 seconds that catches their attention so you don't bore them. Right? They're getting a call. They could be getting 20, 30 calls a day from someone trying to sell your similar service. So you need to stand out, right? You gotta get personal, right? Do they like fishing? Do they like skiing? Do they like uh, hunting? What do they like? Figure out, ask them what they like. I mean, you're not gonna rip right off the rip, ask them, you know, Mr. Customer, do you like hunting? But you need to get to a point where you're doing probing questions and you're getting on a personal level with the customer. So it's not a boring phone call. At the end of the day, I wanna to talk to someone that I can have a conversation with, an educated conversation with, both on business and it will get to a personal side. But the biggest thing you can do is the tonality and mirroring that customer on the other end. Are they energetic? Are they moving like this? Are they going like this? You have to be like that on the other end of the line. You have to act as the tonality that they're coming off on that phone call on the other side of the phone, you need to act that way, right? If they're monotone, you might wanna put it down a bit and you can be more monotone with the customer. They might like a soft voice, but if they're they're active and they're you know mid tone and you know you know they're moving around they're busy you want to act busy on the other end right so you need to mirror them you need to change your tonality and you never want to be a boring person on the other end of the line because as much as you don't want to think how you sit here and you're slumping down and you know you're on your phone you got your your headset going and you're just talking like this you can feel that on the other end of the line. So huge tip this morning, do not be boring. And how are you gonna know if you're boring? If you're getting hung up on, right? You gotta be different, but the main thing you gotta do is be yourself. You can still be yourself and change your tonality, and add humor, you can you know, be personal, but be yourself in the midst of doing that, right? Tonality, change it, but do not bore your customer.